Bonjour! Welcome to our annual Christmas special video. And as every year, we will cook something delicious and special here. Today in the house with me is... Chef Maximilian. So today, <laughs> what, what are we going to cook? Well, it's for Christmas and in the last years we did some biscuits. So yes, cookies. Years ago. Yeah. Uh, we did some Versch blue wine and Verstel. Yeah. So that's some... What's blue wine in English? I don't know, wine. Like that. And some Verstel. And this year we chose to do a little Christmas burger. So what's inside of this Christmas yeah. burger? Let's have a look. The first thing we have are, of course, the buns, typical burger buns, nothing special, we bought these before, we won't do these on our own. But more importantly, what's inside the burger, of course we need some meat. And we don't choose normal meat as the Christmas burger, we bought some duck breast, special Christmas thing. And inside this burger we will not only have the duck breast, but also some potatoes. And not the potatoes in this form, we will do some hash brown potatoes, we have to prepare these. Uh, that's not all of course. Nope, that's not all. We'll also put some onions in there, but also not like this, but some roasted onions. Yes. We'll cook them in the pan yeah. and then they will be brown and we'll put them <laughs> inside of there. And some mayonnaise for, for the sauce. Also get some aioli powder, which is basically some garlic powder to make a little garlic sauce. And we also need, because we have a duck, we need some red cabbage, so we got that too. And also some ketchup, for, because it's a burger. And we forgot something talking about the ketchup, we also have some fries, I guess, right? Yep. So, here they are. Here they are, magically, here we got these, so we also got some fries here. So, these are the raw ingredients, but of course we have to prepare these a bit to then make our beautiful burger. And this is what we will do now. So, we now prepared the ingredients. As you can see, nothing changed basically. We got nice duck breast here, uh, we got our buns, here we got the uh, potatoes and the onions. And yeah, actually, the first step now is to put the duck into the pan a little bit, yeah. and afterwards into the oven, and then we'll continue with the other things, right? That's exactly. exactly. Yeah. So, shall I begin? Yeah, maybe I'll just put it. So, let's heat this up a little bit and a little bit of oil. Not too much because we already got the fat layer on the duck. And now let's just wait for this to get a little bit yeah. hotter. And maybe you think also that, put this. I think that's enough. Like that. Should we start or should we really wait? I don't think we need it now, right? Because it will take. Yeah, but get on a very low heat. Oh, very low. Yeah. yeah. Should be fine. This way here. And then we'll yeah. let me grab this. We can now take. Our duck here. Oh, that looks delicious. With the fat bit. side first, right? That's With the fat side first, yeah, but just need to wait a little bit more until that is really hot. It gets hotter if it's on the. Uh, As you see, we are professional cooks again as every year, so we exactly know what we do. I, I do like cooking actually, yeah, that's true, but liking doesn't mean no. <laughs> <laughs> that's true. No, but that's good. Good. I hope you can see this on the camera. Can, yeah, that's a good point. Guys, we got a second camera. Yeah, we are well prepared as always. Uh, yeah, but let me maybe... Again, this is the cook yeah. at work. Here we yeah, got the duck breast cooking, got the red cabbage in there. Also looks good, I think, but this is the more delicious one. Maybe mm. not for the vegetarian people, I must admit, but uh, yeah, well, you can at least enjoy the video, I hope. Yeah, it's, uh, I think it's a it's a vegan duck actually. It yes. only ate probably some seeds, grass. Yes. So I don't think it was a, a meat eater. I totally agree. So this takes a while now, I guess. I think about yeah. two, three, four minutes. We'll see. Get the fat jumping around here. So yeah. maybe a bit more put that on there. I really like these videos because, as you can see, we are prepared, but it's not like you have to be really careful about yeah. if you walk into the, the video or about outside of the video. Yeah. So that makes it really easier. A bit and more freestyle. Yeah, and I guess for Christmas that's exactly what we enjoy to be honest, so it's not that focused thing, it's a bit more relaxed. So. Yeah, so we agree. I hope, or we hope you like these videos too, so let's maybe flip them. Wait, let me maybe then again grab the camera. Mm. I mean, it looks good in real life, right? Because the camera is a different color grade, it looks even better. So. <laughs> yeah, perfect. <laughs> no, but it looks really, really delicious. And then for the oven, we of course got a little thermostat. 
where we can measure so the... So what's the exact core temperature we have? Yeah. We have, no we idea. don't know it, but we think around 74 degrees Celsius. Yeah. Don't know what that is in Fahrenheit, to be honest. Yeah. Uh, should be alright. So I think I can already take the heat off now. Normally I would put this here on, so the uh, air takeaway thing, take but for sound reasons I won't. Talking about sound, I think I have my hand on the microphone here, I think you have to choose the yeah. mic over there. So, as I said, completely prepared for this video. So I think this should be, yeah, this is coming along really, really and as you well. Said, this is just uh, the first step, we will put it into the oven for around about 20 to 30 minutes, I guess, so then it will be done. By the way, we can argue if it has to be done or not, we will do the duck done, so we don't want it to be yeah. like rare or medium or whatever. Good, so now... Yeah. Wait, give me a second, I have to switch the... Yeah, I need a second anyways. So, now we put so, it into the oven. Yeah. So that's the first one. Put it on there. Here we go. We should have cleaned the oven a bit, but as you can see, we cook a lot here, so oh, we'll be fine. Yeah, let's go let's quickly. Uh, let's see. Yes, that's our boys. These are our boys. <laughs> Look at that. Mmm, very good. So this was um, the most important step, actually. Yeah, was the duck. So I think next on onions or hash brown. Don't know what do you want to start with. Um. I would start with the onions because that's easier. Yeah. And I guess you know how to do the hash browns, right? So yeah. I think we can reuse this yeah, oil. Is it still warm? It's but how warm. do we do it? We just put the onions in and then put some some uh, what's some flour. flour. Some flour, right? Yeah. Do we have flour so yeah. and I need something to work on the onions. Yeah, well they could be on It's fine. Do you want it super hot or medium or I think I not think too hot? Not right? too hot because otherwise it will just make yeah, it just black. So, let me help you. Might have some potatoes in yeah. here as well, but but that's actually the most important thing that it's really this potato mixture. Yeah. You, know? well, it, it, you can't smell it obviously, but it's mm, really good. Let's see some more onions. I think for our other videos, it's quite good that you can't smell. <laughs> <laughs> in the videos, <laughs> because we tend to sit there for quite some time recording and it gets a little bit warm yeah, in there. A little bit, indeed. So now here's what keeps us energized during the videos. Hey, no, just yeah. kidding. That, that's what people are asking, right? How do you stay so energized and how do you do you actually sleep? And here's actually more the sleep. A bit more flour? A bit more, a bit more. I'm talking like it would have been a euro. What's the right? More? Oh, yeah, yeah I don't know. That's, maybe not too much, otherwise it will just be yeah. some. Thing you don't want to eat. Yeah, you don't want to get like this big ma mass which is just disgusting sticking together. Yeah. 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 That is coming along really, really well. And also, as you are asking sometimes, what does a typical day look like for us? That's what it is actually. You know, we start cooking at 11 a.m. and yeah. then we have uh, lunch and then we go to bed. No, <laughs> <laughs> almost. Almost. That's so now time for the hash brown potatoes. And the complete escalation now with two cameras at once. This is just crazy. Wow. Look at these, look at these. More. Is there a single one or both? This is, is this a single one that will, of course, not use it entirely. Yeah, that's what we're going to say because uh, that's. Well, no, we can split it there after. Yeah. I just want to use uh, all of the pan. It <laughs> would be a nice burger of that size, you know. Absolutely, and we must not forget some seasoning. Otherwise it tastes like nothing. A little bit of salt here. Oh, by the way, the onions maybe. I can see we also got these, so... Let's put them in there maybe. We should start a live cooking stream, I guess, one day. I think that would Absolutely. be very interesting. With complicated recipes like this one. Product placement here, of course, on our own brand. That's very important if you do videos like that. Okay, so the first look at the duck. Yeah, I'm not sure if I placed the thermostat correctly, so maybe we're not done yet, but we'll have a look. Because you want it to be entirely done. Um, looks a bit. Let's have a look inside of it. What this looks like. 
Oh. oh, it's not bad, not bad. It just looks, as I said, it looks crazy on the screen. A little, a little bit but Maybe we, if we slice it up later, we can... In the pan a little bit, yeah. yeah. I, I wouldn't eat it like that, to be honest, but if you put it into the pan... We, can, we can let the second one in there. Yeah, for a little while. Now that will be interesting to see. Yeah, it's a big one. So, okay, now I'm just... I messed, I messed this up. Thank you. <laughs> well, we got two. Yeah, now I'm standing in front of the camera. That's so <laughs> smart. <laughs> But it looks like pancakes a bit, I must admit. But I also like pancakes, so... You know the thing is, we don't create the best looking burger, I guess. Some people also say our apps don't look very beautiful, but the important thing is that the burger tastes amazing. The content is important. That's the thing, you know? Wow, but come on, that's really good. It's really good. Mm. That's why we got the uh, ketchup, by the way, not for the duck. Yeah, come on. Yeah. It looks good, right? So... Fine, so let me put these, okay, wait. Yeah, here's our hash brown. That's going on. Should we put it into the oven simultaneously? I guess this is fine. Let's put it below the document. Yeah. Okay. And close it. Good one. <laughs> <laughs> Accident. <laughs> yeah. But as I said, it's about the taste, not about the way it looks. Yeah, and here we had some onions in there, so that yeah, made it okay. a lot harder. Yeah. Almost finished. Oh, that's a little <laughs> bit hot here. And now we add the burger buns. Should we put all? I, I just, do, do we need four? I don't know. No. Maybe, maybe just two. I would just start catching the first yeah, one. Yeah, you're right. So, we're done, we got everything prepared, so let's now build these burgers. So, this is the final result. We are really happy with it. We didn't try these so far, but I guess they will taste very, very good. Look delicious. And I hope you liked the video as always. And your last words maybe for this year. We hope you have a great Christmas, have a great time, a great next year. Yeah. And we hope you stick around. And enjoy your three days and your days off. I hope you yeah. get some, some rest and have time with your families, friends, and so on. And yeah, that's it. Yeah, let's say let's eat. Let's eat. So, so thanks. Bye.